I, 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 I certainly would have thought there would have been more. Um, obviously, I think McTominay was our worst performer, was our worst player last Sunday. So I'm not surprised with him being on the bench, but I am surprised that there hasn't been more changes. I really am. Um, what channel is Man U match on? It's on Sky Sports. It's on Sky Sports. And Owen says, a lot of rumours going around about the young will be happening in the next seven days. Yeah, well, look, there's a lot of reports coming out suggesting that Manchester United are really going to push for him next week. So, you know, watch this space, really. I think we, you know, we do need to make some kind of move if we are going to do it. Uh, but, you know, obviously because Barcelona do have to register with La Liga today. So I think we'll know a lot more, you know, even at the earliest tomorrow. You know. What do you think about the 4-4-3 four, 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 formation, says Troy? Well, that would be uh, 12 players on the pitch. Uh, I'd say you probably said 4-3-3. Three, three. Um, look, I, I'm okay with the formation. It's some of the players that are starting that I'm disappointed with. But look, let's see what happens. Carol says Glazer's out, uh, ruining the club or running the club into the ground. I agree with you there, Carl. And look, obviously there is supposedly some big protests um, planned for before the before the Liverpool game next week. You know, on empty Old Trafford is a protest. To be honest with you, I don't really know what good it's going to do because I mean Manchester United is such a globalized club. There's people going to be traveling from all over the world to go to the games like there is every week. And if people, you know, a lot of people are saying, well, you know, I've had this trip planned for two years, whatever it is. Uh, I just don't see that as being a viable option as, as protests. And I think there's other ways and probably better ways to do it. Owen says, De Jong and a good attitude, Rabio uh, and a right winger and right back would be a great window for now. Yeah, absolutely, Owen. And, and look, I've, I've mentioned it a good few times as well that we can't really expect to sign... 10 or 11 or 12 players in one transfer window. It's just not possible, really, you know. So we do have to be realistic as well. Obviously, the, the three signings we have are good signings, but it's nowhere near enough. You would be hoping more than three. You know, I think minimum six. But uh, let's see what happens in the next couple of weeks. Aaron is in and says, well, good to see Aaron. Thanks for joining us, man. Georgia says United are winning 3-0. Ronaldo or Messi. I'll go on Ronaldo. Um, Shriba says it won't make a difference. Uh, United should let Shaw go instead of Tellez, says Troy. And Martin says, uh, believe, lads, it's only the start. Ten Hag is going to need time. Just watch uh, it all unfold. Yeah, I absolutely agree with you there, 100%. And it's something that I've been saying an awful lot, that, you know, Ten Hag, the Ten Hag appointment has been a long-term vision. And it's not for short-term gains, basically. Um, so, yeah, look, we need to get behind him. There's going to be times like last Sunday when, you know, backs to the wall. So we just need to, you know, we need to, we need to just stay on it. You know, we need to, you know, we need to get behind our team. We need to, you know, back the manager, you know, but I do hope that he can be strong enough to make these tough, tough decisions in playing players that deserve to be played and dropping players that deserve to be dropped, you know. Oh, and by the way, we're back for anyone who is looking for them. With our unofficial sponsor, Aero Melts. I mean, they're just unbelievable. Really, aren't they? Absolutely gorgeous. But anyway. What channel is the match on? It's on Sky Sports, Ethan. Do you think Frankie will join? Says Daniel. I do, Daniel. I certainly do. I've been saying it. I've been saying it now since... Basically since we've been linked with him. Well, maybe a little bit after we've been linked with him.